Hey everybody, it's me again, Kale. Here was more playing Final Fantasy VIII Remastered. Last time we left off, well, Renoa wanted the Squall-themed Grand Tour of the Garden. Because apparently he's the tour guide. With everything calming down these last few days, maybe a week or so, I don't know. Uh, seems, now seems like a good time. This place is huge. I think it's better than Gol bigger than Golbadia? Who knows? Um, can't remember where it is that. What's over there? Parking lot. What about over there? Cafeteria. Squall, I really appreciate you showing me around. But can you try and make it a little more fun? You know, like a normal tour. What does she want from me? This is the parking lot. It is here that we store several company cars. Just a parking lot. Nothing special. That's it? Yeah. Never mind. Let's go. What do you want from me? It's a parking lot! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> um, I think it's Dr. Katawaki's office where the story actually needs me to be, so we'll, we'll hold off on that for now. This is the cafeteria. Obviously, this is where we take our meals. But keep in mind, there's always competition for the good stuff. Especially the hot dogs. Never did understand that, but... Some of the hot dogs are so popular. You know, be lucky to just see someone eat it. That's why you see this long line every day. I see. <laughs> it's so funny. You're so serious with explaining. It just seems kinda odd. You're the one who asked me to show you around. I'm sorry. You don't have to get mad like that. Whatever. Okay, next! Asked me to show her around and calls me odd. Bitch. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, like, worm your way into Squall's good graces. He's, it's not an, not an easy man to get, you know, attached to. Alright, so here's my favorite place in the entire garden. This is the training center. Or as we call it, the monster's lair. The monsters are left to run loose in the enclosed area. And students can feel free to, can feel, ugh. Students can get a feel for actual combat. God, I can't read. Or articulate. Wanna try? You know, I can imagine you doing this on a first date. You're so romantic. Date. I mean, I'm just giving you a tour. You wanted to see the place. Anyway, it's the lake. Um... Come to think of it, I don't think we have a whole lot of aquatic monsters around here. It's mostly just Gratz and that T-Rex that wanders around. You remember him, we kicked his ass earlier. So, you spend a lot of time here, right? Yeah. Is this, like, the only thing you do for fun? You make it sound like that's a weird thing. It's a little weird. I mean... I suppose I also play cards, but... This doesn't do with anything. Always restocking your lower level spells. Variety is the spice of life. 
Oh, hey! It's our friend! Hey, big boy! I can't card it today, because my, uh... My card machine is gone, but I can, uh... You know... Beat the... Beat the crap out of you. And I think I might just do that, because you're... You've got a lot of good stuff on you. Angelo! Also because I have significantly better stats than I did the first couple of times we met, so... Yeah... I assume a third level spell that isn't his weakness will do more than a first level spell that is his weakness. That's my assumption anyway. Probably pretty close to right. Let's actually do the test. About the same, actually. Like Blizzard might have actually been a couple of points higher. Woof. I want another Dino Bone. Need more Quake. One dead T Rex or I'm not really dead. I like my established lore that that thing just is the same one every time and it never actually dies, just knock it the fuck out. Kind of like Gohan during his training with Piccolo, it's constantly carving off the same T Rex's tail every day. Oh yeah, I need to check my GFs to make sure they're all learning good stuff. I mean, I imagine they are, since they didn't get anything from the AP they received. Um, admittedly, there's nothing good that you can learn anymore, Ifrit, so do your thing. You do you, buddy. You do you. Oh. Did you finish learning something? Uh, I guess so. Go back to learning cover, please. Thank you. I must have missed a lot of things. I'm not paying attention anymore, apparently. Um, magic, please. Thank you. Ooh, does that mean Renault has... Yeah, it does! Uh... Regen would be the best call. Do I have something that can even compare to regen and vitality, though? Which is currently at 107. Woof. I don't think so. Death looked like it actually had a pretty potent effect, so... Kiraga might be better once I actually have more of it. You know, hold that thought. I do. Perfect. Um, bam. Now what are you looking like? Yeah, there we go. Alright. Alright. Now she's the proper tank. Tank Renoa! 
Engage! Magic or spirit? How much spirit would she lose if I did magic? A3 versus what was it before? 94 or something like that? 99. Whoa. Uh, what's her magic like at this level? 61 versus... 51. 10 points. Until I can upgrade her magic junction... I think I'll just leave it at where it is for now. Yeah, there's not a whole lot I can do for it right now, so... I think we're okay. We'll come back to that later. We gotta finish our romantic stroll around the crazy death pit. I mean, that's actually the date spot, Squall. That's all, that's all I'm saying. Never mind. I forget what all triggers conversations with Renoa. I just... I needed to cover my bases. I gotta remember that Squall's bad at this. Like, actively worse at it than I probably would be. And I'm a mess. Oh, there's Katawaki. I don't want to engage with her yet. Oh my god, books! Wow, this is cool! Uh, mind if I look around? Oh, it's here that things actually step forward. Damn. Oh well. I guess we'll never know what happens if I go to the fucking quad or Dr. Katawaki's office. Oh, or maybe I can just take off. Alright, that's fine. Uh... Because I know what's... At least I think I know what's over there. We'll go back to that after we go to the, the quad and Dr. Katawaki's. Unless something else happens. Because again, I don't remember all the triggers of this part. Of this part. But I gotta go see the quad. I should probably go show her the nurse's office because that's an important facility. Really nothing to say, Squall. You're boring. Man, just gazing at the ocean kind of makes you forget about all that studying we've endured. The boundless ocean. I wonder what's to become of us. I don't know. I think we'll be graduating for a while. We go far, far away. You know what? I'm never gonna get my garden friends. Yeah, let's be sure to keep in touch even after we graduate. And let me know right away when you get yourself a boyfriend. Gossip. <laughs> I'm worried about mom and pop back in Balm. Balum. I actually recently learned it's pronounced Balam. I don't know why. But it is. But I knew a time like this would come eventually. Time for me to embark on a never ending journey. Yeah, he he's definitely the guitar guy. That is some peak guitar guy rhetoric right there. My never ending journey through life begins today, man. Now, listen to me as I pluck along these strings. Ah. 
Hi there, Squall. Oh my. It's not every day that I see you walking around with a girl. Is she a girlfriend? Why does everyone keep insinuating that? Nah, no, I'm just showing her around. Squall. Did you just say yes for fun? Alright then, yes. Oh. Uh. Say it like you mean it. <laughs> Guys are cute. I mean, nobody ever talked to me about whether or not this is going to be a thing. Am I just doomed to be the last one to know whether or not I'm in a relationship? That's fine. Guy works too hard. Tell him to come see me when you see him. Student ID number 41269. Nice. The Garden Master wishes to see you. Report to the Master's Room right away. Where's the Master's Room? Take the elevator to level B1. We have permission. Go fuck yourself, I still got a library to see. I beg your pardon? Look, don't you get my- You are to report to the Garden Master- <laughs> Sorry, force of habit. Hmm. Maybe I was misremembering. So why are there floating books here? Weird. If there's a book you're looking for, please let one of the library committee know. We'll be happy to help you. Library girl with pigtails is actually a very important character. You wouldn't know it just by looking at her immediately, but she is. Master's level, master's level. This button? I was told never to push this button. Oh, oh, I see why. This place is weird. How did we not see this when we're going down to the basement? I... I don't know. Please, listen to me! Headmaster's here. Where are you going? Hmm? I'm looking for the headmaster. Let go of me! I'M NOT FINISHED! Greedy <laughs> son of a bitch! Why did I even bother talking to you? Seeds were brought up for the future. And the future is now! Why can't you understand? Ten years or so. Tell myself that you're nothing but a money-grubbing son of a bitch. And I would have never built this place. Uh, and I would have never built this place. Oh. Squall? You heard everything. Yes. Uh, I'm embarrassed, but sometimes even old men like me lose their temper. Let's get out of here. Hmm. Sir, I still have to give my report. Come to my office later. The seeds who returned from Galbadia, correct?
Yeah, we are. Why? It's about time. Master Norg has been waiting for you. Come. Norg. Do you want a Norg? No. I have no idea who this Norg is. Seconds are up. What is that? Is that Garden Master? Writer of the Garden? He's not human? I couldn't think of it. We didn't know anything about him. Well, that's a shock. Fushivoro, <laughs> Fushivoro. Give your report on the sorceress. <laughs> now, where do I start? Answer him quickly. Be concise. We failed to assassinate Sorceress Idiot. It'd be a sad report at this rate. Confirmation of Headmaster Sid's order was made at Gobadia Garden. After Irvine Kinnis, the Gobadia Garden joined our party. We set off to carry out the source of assassination order. Operation United Chocoba. From Bullum and Garden. From Bullum and Gobadia Gardens. Bullum and Gobadia's orders. You were fooled. Ooh. I don't understand. Explain to them. Master Norg has known about the alliance between the President of Gobadia and the Sorceress. You heard it from the Gobadia Garden Master himself. Body a garden master? The master of Goldbodya Garden is a subordinate of mine named Martine. Yes, in fact, the sorceress and the gar and garden are closely connected. That is why the sorceress will definitely try to gain hold of all gardens. So, Master Norg sent an official order to Golbadia Garden. It's to kill the sorceress, an assassination. That to be the best means. But... Sly Weasel Martin used you as a last resort for the assassination. Gave that order to place the blame on me! That... That bastard! Saying that Balam Garden had nothing to do with that order? You just happened to show up just before the mission was to be carried out. They used you. The operation failed. The sorceress is still alive, and. The sorceress retaliated just as we suspected. No doubt it was the sorceress who had ordered the missile attacks. Something must be done to calm the sorceress's anger. In order to do so, we need to hand over those involved in the assassination to the sorceress. We had to show Balam Garden's sincerity. Wait a minute, that's just... For the seed's head on a silver platter, pretend we obey the sorceress. What? Why aren't we fighting the sorceress? What about all the training we endured every day? What good is it? What did you say? You lost to the sorceress. Quit your whining.
Badmaster Sid was saying the same thing. Hey. Yes. Sid. Idiot. Sid dispatched Sid to kill the sorceress. If you fail, this garden will be done for. My garden. It will be all over. Idiot Sid. Has he forgotten that it was I who put up the money to establish this place? I wanted to offer the sorcerer Sid's head along with the seeds. I ordered the students to find Sid, but they sided with him. This is my garden. No, it's not just yours. And what is it? Sids and Adias, the pathetic married couples. What? You're dropping a whole lot of lore bombs on me all of a sudden. Headmaster and Adia are married? I don't get it. Now I understand. Sid and Adia are trying to take God away from me. You're one of Sid's followers, aren't you? Prepare to die. Squall! Well, this took a turn. Also, we're out of time for the day. So, uh, boss battle first thing in the, uh, in the next episode. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves as, uh, Norg is preparing his magic... Fortress? Against us? Uh, and if you are, please let me know both, like, comment, subscribe. And we'll come back next time. Kick his ass. Till then, you'll have a subscribe today. I'll see you next adventure. Later!